Hello, in today's video I'll talk briefly about the last race of the Formula 1 2021 season and give my initial comments about the upcoming 2022 season. The championship was crowned by the Red Bull Racing Honda team driver Max Verstappen who was super super fast during the entire season. However, the authorities and the teams are still questioning the decisions were made by the FIA Formula 1 race director. Michael Massey. Max and Lewis start the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix with equal points in the championship, therefore who was going to finish a ball between them going to be the world champion. In the first lap there was an incident between Max and Lewis. Lewis cut the corner and did not give his place back to Max. Later Red Bull team was furious about that decision and talked with the FIA race director and they had decided that there was no further investigation necessary. Until lap 53 Lewis was leading the entire race and the Red Bull team were in short hands. Then Nicholas Latifi had crashed and the safety car was out on the track. The time between Lewis and Max before the safety car was around 13 seconds and Red Bull had nothing to lose and called Max into the pits with a cheap pit stop. He became second after the pits and Lewis did not come into the pits because they were leading the race and if they had stopped they would have gone out behind Max. Also Lewis's engineer Bono told that the race would end behind the safety car with that assumption. In lap 56 the FIA Formula 1 race director and Michael Massey said that the lapped cars would not unlap themselves, but this was very unusual in the Formula 1. Since nearly in every race, the back markers unlapped themselves by passing the front pack. Nevertheless, in lap 57, Michael Massey made another decision that the lapped cars will unlap themselves and uh, corrected the particularly wrong. Moreover, a couple of seconds later, race director said that the safety car will come in this lap and the race will start. However, it says in the FIA sporting regulations that the safety car must come into the pits at least one lap later than the announcement of the decision. With the team's pressure and for a potential last lap drama, Michael Mass says this decision was very very controversial because Max had the nearly non-used softest tyre compounds versus Lewis having the 30 lap old hard tyres. Only the cars between Lewis and Max, which are the back marks in other words, the lap cars had taken their laps back. This action has also never been seen probably in the Formula 1 history. Later in the last lap Max passed Lewis and became the Formula 1 world champion. Lastly the rims are going to change from 13 inches to 18 inches, the Formula 1 cars are going to get smaller, the front wing and the rear wing will also change but I consider the teams are going to find a way to sneak the rules a little bit and uh, develop the cars in distinct ways. Also I consider overtaking will be much easier due to downforce of the car and the airflow coming from the front car will not give that much dirty air like in the previous years. As I have seen the model of the 2022 Formula 1 cars with my eyes when I was in the Istanbul Park Grand Prix, I consider it looks more of an Indy car, however if that aerodynamics and the chassis will increase the potential overtake numbers, I'm definitely fine with that. All in all, the 2021 season was a really good one, a very challenging one for the teams and a joyful one for the viewers, I guess. I hope there will be many teams who will be competing for the podiums and I want to see the former world champions Fernando and Sebastian will win at least a race. It's that for today and it's tennis and I hope to see you in my next videos. Bye bye.